Hi everyone, Rodrigo here once again for one more Tableau Prep video and today guys I'm gonna show you how to do some filters with numbers and text on Tableau. I will show you how to customize the filters in order to do a lots and lots of things, okay? So check it out! Okay guys, here I see my screen of Tableau Prep. So I'm gonna go moving back into the Superstore data sample. Click once, then we have this data sample, okay? I will use this first workflow as our example to do the filters. And then I need just to identify which field is a text one, okay? I can choose this state as the text one and number we will move on to sales okay so we will just started with text filter so first of all we need to use this kind of step okay we have to add the step call it clean step all right this is the right step to create the filters right then you have to check each field do, which field do you want to change the filter for example i want to change this one the state because it is a text field as i told you before and if i click it here i can just skip only and then automatically tableau prep just selected only this okay this is a filter this is a regular filter for text but i want to show you more uh more beyond on this okay so i will just erase this step over here Okay, this one as well, the new. Okay, no change applied yet. Then moving back to the estate, then click once. Then guys, you have just to move right a little bit until this uh, symbol with three dots, then click once, then you see filter, okay? On base selection, we have this different kind of filters that we can apply for text okay the first one is related to calculation okay if you click it here you can add some expression in order to filter for example if i want to filter alabama i would say uh, state equal uh, alabama okay then i can just apply over here this is almost the same that I did before, okay? This is the sa almost the same, but I can continue with the calculation and say like state uh, equal Alabama or state equal another one. For example, let me see. Okay, I need to move in back a little bit. I will just copy this structure, then delete this part save remove this part over here and then i will check for example georgia right so i will put it georgia alabama and georgia so again filter calculation uh, then paste the structure that i already, already copied then state equal alabama or state equal georgia okay Okay, guys, here we can see that we have Georgia and Alabama in our filter. So I filtered both, but I want to just merge this filter with a filter in other field at the same time. I want to use a little bit more complex filter here. So what uh, can I do? I will just start it with parentheses. We have to put it the parentheses over here and in the end of this expression. This is action, all right? Then I will just change for double equal symbol. Then with this structure ready, I have just to double the parentheses as well, all right? So I will just start the parentheses here and close over here. That's the first step of this complex filter. What, what I mean with this with complex filter, I mean, how can we add two fields at the same filter? That's my point. So I will say the state needs to be equal Alabama and also uh, equal Georgia. And and as I'm speaking, it's the same, the same structure of this expression. So I will just continue with, I will just do enter here, just to go to the another line, then double parenthesis. Then I will say ship mode, 
for example, equal, but double equal, equal uh, first class, all right? Then parentheses and parentheses. This is the structure. If I apply it, I can see right now that I have Georgia and Alabama over here and also ship mode as first class over here only first class okay guys i just created a calculation that i first of all the filter selected alabama and georgia and then chip mode equal first class i can continue here saying first class or another ship mode then i can add more expression like and blah 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 with another field it's up to you all right i'm just showing you how to start this complex filter with calculation in text fields all right i will just click on save right now then erase this part just delete this step and then moving back to state again click once then three dots then filter then let's move on to selected values all right so click once over here and from this window we can select the fields to keep and also not the fields sorry guys the information the data to keep or the data to exclude it's up to us okay i will be started with exclude because exclude is something different keep only you already know if you click it here and then keep only you will keep just this filter it's like a regular filter right i will just choose exclude and i will say alabama i don't want to work with alabama on my data set so i will click in alabama over here sorry not over here i will click in the right side all right i will click here just put it this flag and then i can see that tableau prep already put it the text alabama with the line above right then i will click on done and i don't have alabama anymore in my data set this is like the opposite of keep is about exclude all right this is the second option of filter we have the third one white card match this means how to exclude or keep some text that contains something in the exp expression or it starts with ends with or exact match exact match guys is almost like keep only if you select something and keep only means exact match but i can say for example florida i will say i want to exclude every single uh, data that's contain id for example then <clears throat> okay i want to choose exclude okay every single one that's contained id as you can see here this is a previews of the future a previous result i don't have the this guys anymore for example id i have only id together in florida all right florida expression if i put exclude i will keep the other informations instead uh florida all right then i can put it to start with if i put it start with there's nothing to exclude or keep but if i change here for example for fl florida will disappear automatically check no more florida right this is the same the same uh, way that we work with ends with so if you put it for example eia i will see the georgia's just disappeared look at no more georgia in our data set okay we have this three options to filter uh text information in our data set okay let's move on to the second part of this video related to advanced filters with numbers with numbers all right so let's move into sale i want to see the sales in different way i want to see this structure is okay if you want to keep or exclude, just click it here in the number and then keep or exclude. Okay, this is the regular version of filter, the same as works with text fields or another kind of field, doesn't matter the, type, the data type. Okay, this is the same way to basic filter some information, some data, all right? But if we click in the three dots, we have different kind of informations in this advanced filter. We have also calculation 
calculations will be the same. Tableau Prep just opened this window and we can just create an expression in order to filter our information. I don't want to move moving, moving forward on this because I already showed you how to do with text. I want to show you the other options, selected values and not and more range of values the values this is the the one that i want to show you so select values first works as the same as you can see here keep only or exclude okay you just select it and then tableau prep filter over here then you click on done and you will see disappearing the information but i don't want to work with that i will just click on done done nothing applied yet then moving back to these three dots filter and then range of values and this we have three options uh different op different options uh, compared with text filter right on text filters we had some information about content starts with ends with or exactly match here we have a range of values for example i want to work only with the sales that is starting 3000 for example then Tableau Prep creates the filter. Or even we can create some minimum range. For example, start at least with 6,000 and more. Okay, now we have another kind of filter and the same work with maximum, but in the opposite way. Uh, it started with zero. I cannot edit this part because if I want to edit the uh you start in the end point of our numbers we have to move on to range okay and then select both in maximum i'll just create the maximum for example from zero to five thousand and then tableau prep filter this information if you wanna if you want you can use this scroll over here to select your number okay and tableau prep always always show you the minimal number and the maximal number of your data set all right guys so that's how works the filter with numbers all right so guys as i told you that's how filters works with text fields and also number fields i hope you like it if you like it don't forget to thumbs up don't forget to leave your comments down if you have any questions or concerns it will be a pleasure to answer you and please don't forget to share this content with anyone that you think will be interested okay that's all for today and see you in the next video bye